people peace of Christ to all today I have a news for you did you know that they found that the invention of television is exist in the Quran did you know that it's right in front of your face this is the website of Harun Yahya uh, Harun Yahya became the comedian of the uh, I don't want to say 21st century 22 century you know what a, what a what a crazy man this guy honestly let us see how the invention of television exists in the Quran. let us see they are saying in his website uh, the invention of television uh, we came to our home etc and, you know okay television waves fast uh, the transmitting uh, pictures kilometers whatever and then he say in Surah an naml of the Quran that this will describe how the Prophet Salmon he was able to get the throne of the Queen this is the Queen Balqis by the way and by the way the Quran says that uh, uh, Suleiman he have a flying carpet too uh, in a very very high speed and they are saying this is must be the television but not only that no 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 just wait there's a discovery in there <coughs> this is the verse in the Quran insu and they are saying the word television is there you know uh, Arabic is my first language and I have no idea what those people are talking about let me read for you again and you tell me if you if you hear anything have to do with television والإنسو والطير and specifically you see where the red line exactly exists I'm going to read those letters نس والطي نس والطا where is television look what they did they took part of this world not all the world because as you see in here uh, very weird people man they delete this part of the world this world this part of the world is gone and this part of the world is gone too and then they want to convince us that those letters N and seen and Wa and L and Ta is television how let us see they are saying the first letter is N okay the first letter is N but in here they have Ni what Ni from where you get the E do we see an E there? There is no E. So the first lie they did, they add letter E. Okay. The second letter is S. But S became C. From where you get the E. S became C. Okay. The third letter is Wa. How the Wa became V. Wa, Wa, Wa. You know what Wa? At least make it a W, U, etc. But how the Wa became V? From where you get the E2? Those two are not exist. The correct way is Wa is, you can say U or you can say W, you know. But V? What a big fat liars. Then the letter after is Aleph. How Aleph A? Aleph mean you know, when I say Aleph, it's like A. How it became E? Since when the A is E? Then the L became LE. From where you get the E? Then the letter Ta. You know, first in, in English we don't have uh, you don't have equal letter to Ta, but we can say T is close to it, so we can accept T. But from where you'd get the T E? T alone, no problem. But E from where you are getting the T? So look how many letters they add. Those professional liars. One letter, two, four, five, six, seven. Now if we take those letters out, what is left? Nas L T Nas L T Let me write it This is what is left After all of this N S L T 
Where is, the where is the TV? In the same time, those uh, Arabic words is from the right to the left. For him, he wants you to read from the right, from the left to the right. Because in Arabic, we read it from right to left, in case you don't know. So, there is nothing there. there those people are so desperate. They are mental. You know, I, I, I say it in my own way, in a funny way. Uh, stupid mental. You know, le learn how to say it. Those people, they are stupid mental. They have a disease in their head. They are so desperate to find anything as a miracle in their book. This is supposedly the inv invention of a TV. So they have to add this letter, and 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 this letter. And they have to make you read it from the upside down, from the wrong direction. And that will make a TV. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. Amazing, brother. Let us say something else and love more. Because, yeah, there is more invention. And this is nothing, man. Just This is the start. Just wait. The Quran speak about the heart massage. Mm -hmm. Where is that? This is in chapter 2, verse number 72-73. But, you know, this is their translation. And read with me. Did even the word heart mention there? No. Did anybody speak about hands touching anything? No. Simply this is a story about a man was killed and uh, 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 Moses people they came to him asking him you are a prophet of God tell us who is the one who, t who killed this man. Ask uh, God who did that. This is a story exists in the Quran. So Moses uh, uh, his God told him okay go and get some shish kebab uh, a fee, a beef or you know a tail of a cow let me show you let me show you we don't make lies you know we don't we don't make things up let me show you this is chapter 2 verse number 72 this is the Jordanian government uh, uh, website owned by the king of Jordan and this is Ibn Abbas the cousin of Muhammad himself explaining the verse this is not my interpretation so nobody say I'm lying I know you Muslims I know you then Allah mentioned the murder person saying remember when you uh, you slew a man uh, and I in concerning his murder and Allah brought forth which you were hiding which means the one who killed him if you go to the verse number 73 let us see they continue because they are mentioning there are two verses 72 and 73 let us see what it says okay and we said submit him the murder person the murdered person with some of it with an organ of a cow and it's also said with its tail or tongue imagine you know and this is what happened guys read it Moses Allah told him get a tail of a cow or the tongue of the cow and beat the guy with it and he will come to life and he will tell you who killed him and uh, Moses he did beat uh, Abdul the one who was killed by the tail of the cow or the tongue of the cow and he came back to life and he said the one who killed me is Muhammad and he came back dead again and this is how they knew how they, they he was killed okay kids if you want to sleep now you can sleep yeah this is a this is a bedtime story amazing now where is the heart massage they are speaking about this is so, this is a fairy tale story speaking about uh, like can we now do it can this massage work today or this is supposedly a miracle you liars muslims beating somebody with some beef he will come back to life so either you say it's a miracle or you say it's a science. If you say it's a science, it means we can do it right now. We just beat the dead man with the tail of the cow, you know, and that's it. He will come back to life. This is why I want to save always a tail of a cow in my house. You never know when you need it. And you know what? Somebody call the FBI and tell them, you know, if you have a murder, you do not know who is the killer. Simply just, uh, uh, you know, buy a tail of a cow or a tongue of a cow and beat the guy with it. And he will come back to life. Praise Allah, brother. You must be now ready to convert to Islam and uh, accept all those lo lovely stories which you can tell them for kids and they will enjoy them. 
Praise Allah and see me in the coming video. Allahu Akbar. Abdul say hello. Bye-bye. Christ is Lord. Islam is false. Ameen.